often it is useful to be able to calculate the period given a trig function equation. Let's first look at an example and find the period by inspection. So given sine of 2x, plot the graph and find the period. So we have a coefficient greater than 1 inside the brackets, which means we are going to shrink the graph by a factor of 2. I find it easiest to first draw the regular sine wave and then divide the main values by 2. So this is going to give us a wave that looks like this. To find the period, we just need to find the smallest non-repeating chunk of the wave. Since we shrank the graph by a factor of 2, and our period was originally 2 pi, it makes sense that our new period will now be 2 pi over 2, which is just pi. We can see that on the graph as well. More generally, we can come up with a formula for finding the period of any sine or cosine function. So for sine of nx or cos of nx, we can see that the period is equal to 2 pi over the absolute value of n. We take the absolute value because period should always be positive and sometimes the coefficient n may be negative. So we just want to cancel that out. In the case where we're only given the graph of the sine wave, this allows us to predict what the coefficient in the brackets is going to be.